G'day, it's Rolly from CQ University here. This is a quick video to show you a couple of things you can do to improve your connection quality using Blackboard Collaborate. So if you're having problems like audio skipping, um, this is a couple of things you can try. As you can see, I'm on a Mac, so if you're on a PC, it may look a little different. What you want to do is find the preferences, which on a Mac is under the, uh, the Blackboard Collaborate menu and on a PC should be under the edit menu. So I'll open the preferences up. If you scroll down, you can click on session and under the connection speed, just make sure that you've selected the right connection speed for the connection you have. So if you're on the CQ University network, set it to the LAN. If you're on broadband at home, try the DSL one. If you are on broadband but it's a wireless, like a Telstra 3G or something like that, use the wireless option and ISDN and below aren't really going to cut it for video conferencing. But that said, if you've got problems, just say you're on 3G and you find that your audio is skipping, maybe your bandwidth is down a bit, so then what you want to do is come in here and try ISDN. So whenever you've got problems, come in and knock the setting down one. So if you're on the network here and you're finding that it's struggling, bump it down to DSL. But if you're on DSL at home and you're finding that it's struggling, bump it down to wireless. So that's one thing you can do. The other thing you can do is tell the Collaborate server to only send you a certain amount of frames per second for the video. So if you scroll up from the session preferences and click on the audio video preferences, you can see here that you can tell it to cap the video frame rate. Now this tells the Collaborate server how many frames to send you per second for the video. So if your audio is skipping, maybe the, the video is taking up too much of the bandwidth, so you might want to try and reduce that down a bit. Have a bit of a play with it, press OK see how it goes, come back in and tweak it, you may need to change things a few times. So that's it, hopefully that helps, thanks.